Good afternoon, everybody. Thank you very much for inviting me to this uh, conference. Uh, um, my name is uh, Matthias Mocha. I'm a professor for social um, education in, in the uh, Cooperative University of Stuttgart, uh, Baden-Württemberg, Alemannia. And um, I um, want to tell you something about our studies in uh, the early professional biography of, this, of alumni of the program of, of our program of social work. And um, I want to um, make it very briefly, so I have the main results here in, the, in my text. Um, academic studies of social work have changed considerably in the, ten, the last 10 years, following the introduction of the new bachelor and master degrees uh, the courses. There has been a reassessment of uh, study content and reorientation in regard to basic professional graduate qualification. Graduates are is, is expected to focus on competence during their studies and to prepare for a process of lifelong learning, as the European Commission uh, um, is uh, saying. The, the, these changes go along with the hope of an easier a transition um, of graduates from their studies to working life. However, there is very little experience how, of how far the necessary orientation towards competence is actually working and how the graduates transi transition to work life is tuning out and which professional path they choose after their studies. How do they use their qualification in regards to further specialization, career and further education? Do they stay in their original field or do they frequently change their initial area? Or how do they combine work and family and other personal interests? So we want to show how the competences they get in the university are useful for uh, everyday life and uh, their life in, uh, in their workplace. Uh, so the subjects of our um, um, research is uh, the um, conditions of the start of the professional careers of social workers. Our subject is uh, now um, the result of the program uh, we have in our studies and um, which uh, um, uh, the experience w which the uh, students can use from the du dual career, uh, dual form of our study, so the, uh, the our students switch from the workplace to the university every three months, they have a, a three year switch uh, every three months uh, between university and the workplace. So um, we uh, look at the for three years after leaving university um, and um, uh, have a, a, the aim to look uh, uh, on the sufficiency of the, our program, our special program of this um, um, form of uh, studying and we look at the attitudes and the motivations and the biography, uh, biographical preliminations of alumni how do they, are they prepared through their own lives and through university for the workplace. And three cohorts have to be assessed out of all the alumni for the program. So we have a representative sample of the students. The research project allowed each of, a, a, a followed each of a duration of about two and a half years. These panels consist of graduates working in different fields of social work as well as for, from different years. We have uh, these uh, uh, this, uh, years, and they, they, they finished 2009, they finished 2010, and they finished 2011. And you see the studying is just ongoing. We have these uh, three cohorts and um, can look um, uh, about the difference um, between the cohorts and the, um, the things they uh, uh, are common in the cohorts, uh, how they uh, get in the workplace. 
the design includes uh, a continuous biannual and twice a year uh, written survey based on cohorts. The results deliver biannual information where the graduates have found a workplace, how long they stay in one place, workplace, and how much need uh, for further education there is, and so on. We have um, assessed uh, very many variables in this uh, uh, design. So our data allow for changes and development in this experience over time. Apart from these continuously recurring questions, or ever the, the same questions every half a year, where you are working, how is your motivation, um, what, what do you earn, and so on. Um, despite of these uh, questions, we have uh, in several uh, um, uh, questionnaires topics, specific, specific topics, um, which change from one assessment to the next. Um, in this um, short presentation, I can show you only very few of the complex results. At first, we will look, look at the amount of employment of the alumni in the first two years of their working life. As we can see, just after leaving university, about two-thirds um, of the alumni get immediately uh, in the job. Um, uh, many of them stay in the placement they know from their practicum, so they uh, change the workplace where they have uh, their practicum uh, and, and will uh, um, um, stay in the institution they know from their practicums. After 10 months, um, we uh, reach a, a rate of about 90% of the students um, in uh, participant in the workplace. So we have a very high range of um, working um, people in this uh, sample. Uh, so we have a uh, um, reflect uh, uh, on the aim of our studies, and so we have um, seen how uh, many uh, students uh, get in the workplace. There's an increasing percentage of persons um, with full-time employment, the blue uh, parts of the um, columns, whereas the part-time um, people are uh, stable about 25-24%. Uh, Only uh, very few alumni were working as freelancers. This is a field of um, uh, whether very few um, students um, uh, very few alumni uh, work in the freelance uh, form uh, as social workers. What, uh, uh, um, what, when, when not, what we cannot see here is the amount of changes between different uh, workplaces in the first year of uh, uh, the, uh, the work that we have in the first year, many changes between uh, several uh, workplaces. Um, how can I go to further? So, furthermore, I would like to show you some data about the relevance of competencies. Nine months after work entrance, the graduates estimated the competencies which are expected in their workplace. The questionnaire made a difference between professional and practical competencies. In, in this feature, uh, feature, we only show the means of the ratings of the professional competences as, uh, in a scale between one and five. As most, uh, the most important competencies, uh, the graduates estimated personality um, and personal uh, attitude. Uh, um, this result shows clearly the high relevance of personal growth and development of reflexivity during their studies. In regard to manage their own um, their work, uh, graduates also need competences in planning um, um, and uh, conception in the workplace, the, um, which is in the third position of the range of the competencies. The most academic competencies in knowledge and understanding um, um, we, re, uh, we rate, uh, they were rated in the middle of the scale, and investigation and research seems to be less important when they look at the daily routine of their work. So um, we also had a look on the satisfaction of the alumni in their workplace. The greatest amount of satisfaction is based 
on the aspects which are very closely related to social conditions and forms of communication in the workplace. Good experience in teamwork, confidence in the line manager, and uh, a good working atmosphere range on the top of the scale. But also the possibility of realizing own ideas, meaningful contents and of the work and job security are highly satisfaction aspects. When we look at the development of satisfaction over time, um, we have three, three waves um, uh, here, three months um, after uh, university, um, nine, nine months after leaving university and 15 months after leaving. The already lower estimated aspects as working hours, uh, career opportunities are reduced after one year in the workplace. In regard to their general satisfaction in the workplace, the graduates definite, uh, definitely experience a clear decrease um, in their satisfaction in their first year of work. So. <coughs> Um, in this paper, we only can uh, report only very few findings of our work overall uh, results um, show that the graduates have a great benefit because of the, the dual structure of the study program. In our report, we, the reader can, can find much more information about different aspects, so as amount of earnings, the duration of job agreements, the most of these aspects are reported in length. Our findings will, read, uh, will lead now to uh, theoretical considerations in behalf of the reciprocal process of developing the theory and practice co connections in the professional uh, work and how uh, the program, study program will, uh, can be uh, um, made better uh, for the uh, students so they can learn uh, in a, um, a way they have a, a greater satisfaction in the workplace when they leave university. Thank you.